We are going to get the phantom armor. And this is the first cave that we need to go to. It's a hole up above us. So this is at Puffer Beach, right here at the south side of Hyrule. Very much south on the beach here. So you need to find a way to get up there. So there's actually a two rockets here. If you fuse a rocket to a shield, you get a little uh, rocket boost. You can use this to go up into these caves. Here we go. Love it. Oh, it climbed up out there. So Puffer Beach Overhead Cave Discovery. We have some horriblins that we probably surprised. I can imagine that'd be pretty surprising. Oof, he got me. I thought I would be able to get him before he got me. But nope. Let's try again. Okay, got him the second time. Sweet. So, whenever you see these pillars with the clothing kind of hanging off of them, that's an indication that there is a piece of armor in the cave that you're at. So, we know we're in the right place. And sometimes the the poles with this clothing or, or you know fabric falling off of it will point you to the cave or to the location right here the first piece has been discovered the phantom helmet Ooh, eight defense that's super good now where's that bubble frog why do i feel like i should go through oh there's the bubble frog hello bubble frog okay that's the first piece. Let's go to piece number two. The piece location for the second, the location for the second piece of the phantom armor is at the end of this river, right here. There is an entrance to a cave right here and not that far in, you're going to see the tail tell signs of the pole with the clothing on it. Looks like it's guarded by some orblins. Oh, looks like they cannot swim. Unfortunate for them. They probably shouldn't be positioned over a lake if that's the case. Looks like we can take a right or a left. Let's take a right and see where that leads us. Something good, something good. Ooh, the bubble frog. Okay, great. got the bubble frog that was pretty quick double gem now let's go back and take the other fork we'll come back for you don't worry oh and there's the piece right there Ooh, but if you want, looks like there's a fight to be had. A little phantom cannon. Okay. Time for phantom cannon. We just did the hands. Oh, phantom cannon. Oh, a sword phantom cannon. Okay. Ooh, okay, a little... I wasn't close enough, I think, for that move. Ooh, a little late. There we go. Third time's the charm. Nice. One flurry rush. I love it. Bye, Phantom Ganon. Can I please have your dark clumps? Your gloom sword? How are we going to get up there? So, I think a rocket shield is going to be the best way. So, if you have a rocket, you could create a zoning device like a hot air balloon. Well, how do we get in there? Oh, are we on the wrong side? Oh, maybe we weren't supposed to approach from that side. Phantom armor. We already got the bubble frog, so we're good. Okay, let's go to the third location. We are at the third location of the phantom armor here in the Gerudo Desert. Down here. And there are a lot of cave entrances here. And the trick is to pick the right one. So we want to pick the one near the south, not the southernmost one, but the one right above it, I believe. 
So what it looks like here, if you look here, it's this one that we're going for, right here. Okay, so let's drop into that second one and hopefully, ow. Okay, I did not think that through. So you fall into the quicksand, you get entrance into the cave. Perfect, and we are inside this, uh, where the treasure is. Uh, there should be the bubble frog. Hello, bubble frog. Nice. Get the bubble gem. And then we're going to get our last piece of phantom armor. The phantom greaves. There we go. Now we have the full set of phantom armor, and it has pretty good defense as a starting point. Eight, not bad. Plus it looks amazing. And I think this is the one that has the glowing back. Yes, very cool. Love it. I love the purple touches on that. It's, it just looks so cool. Ooh, very scary. Very glowy. Love it. Looks like kind of a shoulder pads look too. Very broad chest. Anyway, yeah, that's how you get the Phantom Armor. And hope you enjoyed it. Bye-bye.